Hey guys, Michelle here from Cashel Creations, and I picked up this No Problem Llama um, 36 sheet stack of 12 by 12 paper pack from Tuesday morning. I went there a couple weeks ago and I just fell in love with the pad of paper. Um, it is double sided and it has a bunch of foiling on certain sheets. Now, I already went through this. Look how pretty that is. They're cacti. Anyways, I went through this because I wanted to get into learning how to make your own chipboard albums. I've never done that before. Um, I came across a tutorial on YouTube. It is seven hours long. Don't fret because it took me two days doing multiple things with family to get it completed. But it's really worth your while. Anyways, I'm not going to keep talking about that. Here is the album. Look how cute this is. Isn't that adorable? And I made this from scratch. Okay, I'm sorry. I just have to brag. So, inside, by the way, it's a 6x8 um, album that I created. And it is with uh, chipboard and cardstock. And <laughs> I made a pocket. Look how cute this is. Look how big. I can stick a whole bunch of stuff in it. Um, I added here some like little tiny, uh, well, I guess it's not really an album, it's a folio. But um, I added some uh, sheets where we can add um, journaling or pictures. And then here is another um, one that I created, but this one's like a little card where you can do stuff in it. And then this flips up and flips down. And then this is a pocket. And then you even have little inserts. Look at that. I haven't done anything with it yet, but my intent is to do it. I first wanted to show you my walkthrough. And then you stick that back inside. And then you flip the page. And then I matted it. Look, there's a magnet. I've never done a magnet before. And then this comes out. And then you close it and it goes boop. And then inside is another pocket. Again, nothing on the back yet. I haven't matted anything with pictures or anything like that. And then here's another flap. Now I did use some Tim Holtz, um, what is it called, uh, washi tape. And then here's a pocket. And then this one I did matte both sides because I used uh, an eyelet. Or not an eyelet, a brad? No, not a brad. I forgot all the words, the terms. And then here's another pocket. And I just loved how the colors of the paper pad, I mean, you do see that I use black cardstock. Um, I also used a light blue and then an ivory color. Other than that, everything else is from the paper pad. And then here is another um, style option. And then here is another magnet. Look how cute this is. Bam. And then these up here. A little mini waterfall and then here and then it just clips together and then there's another insert in here i tried to alternate the patterns and colors because i didn't want it to be too busy so that's why i wanted to do a little cohesiveness and then here is a little belly band and then you just bring this out and then this one is a cute little flip. So anyways, I'm really excited. I really wanted to share this with you guys. Um, I know I keep showing you a whole bunch of haul videos and I want you to see that I'm actually making stuff with it. Of course, as you do know, it does take some time. So um, that is my walkthrough of my first time folio um i will link the video that i did learn how to make this with um which is from country craft creations um again i know it's a seven hour video but i did pause it and rewatch it and get all the measurements i needed to get so that is why it took me the two days time that it took me um and plus it's my first one so i'm pretty sure as i keep going along and doing other ones that i'll get quicker at it um, i do know there's a bunch of different style folios but um i'm like really excited and i can't wait to make more with all the stuff that i've been getting um 
anyways let me know what you think have you made one yourself um would love to know what kind of uh, tutorials you watch or who you watch um, i like to learn more as i keep growing and, and learning from other people um thank you for watching and if you're not a subscriber i would love for you to be if you are one thank you and i'll catch you on the next one take care